first 25 years at Sun have been just huge amounts of innovation. We popularized TCP IP, we stunned the world with NFS, we delivered Spark and Solaris and Java and all of the other new technologies that you've seen Sun deliver and we're on six billion devices. Sun started with a very simple idea which is to take open standards on the software side and combine them with open standards on the hardware side which at the time was apparently quite revolutionary and everybody liked it. So this whole notion of open systems really started with Sun Microsystems 25 years ago. Early on in Sun's career, long before I got here, was a fundamental idea that if you propagated a standard across the world, literally shared it with the world, you would create for yourself more opportunity for yourself and for your customers and all the developers who worked with both of you. Our whole strategy of sharing open interfaces, open source, even open sourcing the hardware is going to create just an explosion of technology. I think what really sets Sun apart is the idea that we live so fully by the idea that you should share your innovation with the world. Sun was really the first company that defined open standards and open systems in the computer area and I have every reason to believe that that strategy will be very successful going forward. I'm not sure any company's ever had a tagline that has been as enduring, as right on the button, as the network is the computer. We tried to identify one phrase that would really show what we were trying to do as a company, which was to make the computer and the network indistinguishable from each other. It is all about giving people access from anywhere, any device, any time, to open and shared technologies and innovations. No one today would even doubt for a moment that the slogan, the network is the computer, is really more true today and will continue to be more true for the next 50 years. I wonder who actually invented and coined it. I know there's a lot of people who take credit for it. It just popped up one day and everybody thought it was the greatest tagline. I don't know who came up with it. The kinds of questions that we're being asked today are really transformative. They're all about scale and security and sustainability. Customers really like our new openness, the fact that we open Solaris, that we are making all the new technologies we're working on available in an open source kind of fashion. More so than I've ever seen in 25 years are more excited about what we're doing, how we're doing it, and our ability to execute. It's a fundamentally different dialogue. It's not so much one where we're educating them about what the end objective is. Now they're totally captivated by the end objective. Now they want to know how do they get there at scale, how do they do it across the globe, and how do they do it quickly and efficiently. So I personally have a lot of contact with customers, and the most demanding ones are actually, in many ways, the best ones. If I had to extend the thanks and appreciation of Sun Microsystems, I'd probably do it to a few different constituencies. First and foremost, the customers that have been with us for nearly 25 years in some instance. These are folks who take the technologies that Sun builds and then they go invent the services that we as consumers see every day. Thanks goes to our customers' insistence that we develop even better products and giving us specific feedback in which areas we can make our products even better to meet their needs probably the most valuable partners that Sun has around the world are in the developer communities, the people who take our raw technologies in open source form or in our basic platforms and they then invent the future. They create the kinds of applications that our customers can use to deliver service out to the marketplace. We have all of our technology partners who are taking our open interfaces and open source code and contributing and, and driving those technologies forward. The most important community that Sun owes a debt of thanks to are the employees at Sun Microsystems today and those that have contributed to the evolution of Sun over the past 25 years. I don't know what the new employee number is for the latest employee, but it's, uh, it's six digits and there's just been a whole host of folks who've been here contributing. And as they leave, they go out and they help. Sun's culture is going to evolve. It probably reflected a lot of what I thought was important in the past, but some of the things aren't going to change. We're going to want to win, kick butt. We're going to want to have fun because we work too hard and too long not to enjoy what we're doing. One thing I'm very confident in is that the Internet's only going to become more useful, more critical, and a more central part of how we do everything. Keep innovating. Keep breaking the rules. Keep sharing. We're a company that's really built out of ideas out of ideas today that we're able to monetize based on product development and ideas about how the world's going to work tomorrow and our ability to go pursue that. It's an army. There's no single person here that is responsible. It's everybody in total that have been driving 
and creating what I think is one of the greatest movements in the modern age. Thank you very much. It's been a great 25 years, and I can't wait for the next 25.